Hey, hi, how are you? Hello, I am fine. Thank you. How are you? I am also good. Thank you. So I got your profile for evaluation, and I am going to evaluate you based on your technical coding skills. Okay, so I have a program for you. Uh, let us consider there is a array of n numbers, which are natural numbers, and you have to find the missing number from that array. Make sure that array doesn't contain a duplicate numbers. Okay, for example, uh, you have an array of one to ten numbers, but there is one number which is missing in that array. So you have to identify which is that number, the one which is missing one. So can I write a code for that? Yeah. Okay. So let me just uh, repeat the problem statement once again. Uh, consider an example. Uh, there is ARR one. Okay. And uh, this is an array. Uh, so I'll try to make a new array out of it. Uh, so new integer uh, array. And I'm going to initialize uh, this with one to ten, as you mentioned. So one comma uh, two comma three comma four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and uh, ten. This is my array, and now your problem statement is one of the natural number is missing from this. For example, five. Then I have to identify that number. Am I right in seeing it? Yes. Uh, yeah, correct. You can remove that five. Yeah. So I'll I'll uh, remove that five. Okay. All right. So yes. uh, these are the set of natural numbers uh, from one to ten, with uh, five not being present in the natural number list. All right, so I'll I'll try to make use of one uh, formula here, which is n n plus one by two. Uh, this formula gives me uh, the sum of first n natural number. So n will be ten in our case. So let's try to find uh, integer sum uh, n n is ten. So n into n plus one, uh, which is eleven, uh, divided by two. So I'm going to perform this operation n n by two. Uh, n n plus one by two, so this will give me the sum of first n natural number. So this will be fifty five. Let me just print this. S y s out or oh, sum. So this will give me the sum of first n natural numbers. Okay, so the sum is fifty five. In our case, I'll take sum of this array, uh, which will be uh, less than fifty five, and then I'm going to subtract uh, our sum from the actual sum. So let's try to get the actual sum. Actual sum represents the sum of the input array. So I'll initialize this to uh, zero, and I'm going to iterate over uh, our array, which is integer i equal to zero. Uh, i is less than our arr one dot length, and then I'm going to do i uh, plus plus. So this is my for loop for iterating over uh, the input array. And while iterating, I'll uh, make sure that I add all the elements uh, to my uh, actual sum. So actual sum is equal to um, actual sum uh, plus uh, the actual element, which is arr one of i. Okay. So this will uh, give me the sum of uh, the input array, which is arr one. Now, uh, to find the missing number, what I'll do, uh, missing number is uh, concatenation, and then uh, I'll do actual, I'll do sum minus actual sum. Okay, so this will give me the missing number, and the missing number is 5 in our case. So let's try to uh, run this program. Uh, so the missing number is five, as you can see. Yeah. Okay. Can you try it with different number? Let's remove eight. Add five and remove eight. Okay. So I've removed. Uh, I've added five and I'll remove eight. Now the output should be eight in this case. Uh, so let me run this program once again. And uh, missing number is eight. Okay. Perfect. Now I have another problem statement for you. So let us consider there is a sentence. Okay. Now you have to divide that sentence into two parts and make sure first part, all the words or all the characters should be in lowercase and second part of that statement should be in uppercase. All the characters of that part should be in uppercase. Uh, hello. Yeah, yeah. I got to... Yeah, so uh, did you get the problem? Yes, yes. Uh, so I have to uh, no. write a, I have to uh, take a string, string str. And consider uh, this is cloud tech, and I'm repeating this string. This is cloud uh, tech. 
Correct. So the first part, which is uh, this is cloud tech, should be in lower case, and the second part, uh, this is cloud tech. This should be in upper case. Yes, correct. Okay. So the first thing I'll do is uh, I'll try to divide the. Uh, uh, I'll take the length and uh, try to find the mid of the string. So to find the mid of the string, I'll do a string uh, dot length uh, divided by two. So the length divided by two will be my mid. Now. I'll try to declare two string. One is a uh, lowercase uh, string, and uh, the other one is the uppercase string. So I'm going to declare two strings, lowercase and upper case. All right. After this, uh, I'm going to iterate over the original string uh, using for loop. So for integer i equal to zero, i is less than uh, str dot length. And I plus plus. Uh, I'll iterate over all the characters of the original string, which is str, and I'll check um, if i is less than uh, mid. Uh, we want to convert uh, the first part of the string to lowercase, so that is the reason we are trying to uh, find the mid. And uh, whenever the index is less than mid, that character should be converted to lowercase. So uh, let's try to. Add the character to the lowercase string. So lowercase equal to lowercase uh, plus uh, the character at ith position. So str uh, character uh, dot to lowercase because I have to convert it to lowercase and then string dot get uh, character at uh, it's string dot caret caret i. All right. And if it is not less than mid, else, else I have to convert it into uppercase because else it is the second half of the uh, string, which is which is this is cloud tech, the second half part of the string. So I'll make sure that I convert all the character to uppercase. So uppercase equal to uppercase uh, plus character dot to uppercase. And str dot character at i. Okay, so this will uh, give me two string. Uh, the first half will be in lowercase string. The second half will be in uppercase string. And the final step is I'll try to uh, concat uh, both the strings uh, out of for loop. So my for loop represents uh, this bracket. Now I'm going to uh, sys out uh, and uh, I'll lowercase. I'll concat it with upper. Case. All right. Uh, may I run this program? Yes. All right. So let me uh, run this program and check if our logic works fine. Uh, so you can see the first half is uh, this is cloud tech in lowercase, and the second half is this is cloud tech in uppercase. Okay. Uh, I'm done from my side. Do you have any question? Uh, no, I don't have any questions. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.